our world, a place full of hope, promise, dreams, and opportunity, yet also a world filled with poverty and devastation. Half of the world, nearly three billion people, live on less than two dollars a day. According to UNICEF, 30,000 children die each day due to poverty. 640 million children live without adequate shelter. 400 million live with no access to safe water. And 270 million live without any access to basic health services. In recent years, we witnessed natural and human-caused disasters, leaving hundreds of thousands dead or homeless and wiping out entire communities in the blink of an eye. This is the world that we live in. This is the world that our generation must take responsibility for. This is where change must begin, here and now. Right now, students from around the world are making that change. Over 1,400 teams involved with Students in Free Enterprise, or SIFE, have been formed in over 40 countries, each finding new and effective ways to educate, change, and empower people around the world through projects using the principles of free enterprise. In the La Sierra University SIFE team, we not only assess weaknesses and needs, but build upon existing strengths and resources to make a tremendous and sustainable impact through our operations. We seek to not only enact an increase in knowledge, skill, and ability, but also in how that increase is applied and utilized. In this way, we are able to create economic opportunity for others where often there seems to be none. By developing long-term multi-phase projects, we are able to effectively use and combine the elements of free enterprise to form a stronger and more sustainable impact than ever before. Projects such as Welfare to Work have transformed lives in our local community of Riverside by teaching more than 700 people over the last eight years how to start a childcare business, generating over $14 million in income. Project Kalala has impacted over a thousand individuals, striving to restructure their entire lives in Ethiopia and assert themselves in the world market. A project that began by sending them a solar oven that continuously feeds 500 students a day, implemented horticulture as a source of expandable income, and provided computers in order to stimulate technological growth. Now in its second phase, we started a sewing project, Kalala Scrubs, to generate another source of viable income for more than a hundred women. And phase one of our Build-A-Village project has shown what is possible when people come together. This project provides hope for those around the world who are in need of infrastructure and human shelter through super adobe building techniques and plans made to start up and increase the sustainability of their communities. Each year the SIFE organization holds a series of competitions where teams from around the world present a report of their team's operations for the year. We took this as an opportunity to share our new ideas, operational philosophies, and even a new presentation style to show what is possible when students come together to make a difference in this world. Our journey began in the SIFE regional competition in Hollywood, California on March 20, 2007. Each presentation round consists of a 7 minute setup period, 24 minutes of presentation time, and a 5 minute question and answer period. In a competition process including teams from more than 840 colleges and universities across the United States, we were excited to join 140 regional champions at the SIF National Competition in Dallas, Texas. On May 6, 2007, teams from across the U.S. gathered together to share their experiences and accomplishments in three days of competition. By the third day, only four out of the original 140 teams remained. The four teams selected were the teams from Heritage University, Drury University, La Sierra University, and the University of Arizona. Our team would take the big stage in front of thousands of students and 116 judges of the final round. With the validation of the judges, our Lasser University SIF team was overcome with excitement as we'd been selected to represent the entire United States at the World Cup competition. The top teams from over 40 countries would gather in New York City on October 10, 2007 to highlight their successes in the highest level of competition. The Lasser University SIFE team continued to share their accomplishments, their new operational philosophy, and their story with passion and conviction. The team made their way through the first rounds of competition 
to finally make it onto the world stage, along with the teams from Nigeria, Albania, and Canada. The Lasser University SIFE team was the last to present for the final round. It was now up to the judges, selected from all around the world, to choose who would be the world champs, and all the SIFE teams waited for the announcement of the results. Your SIFE World Cup 2007 World Champion is the team from the United States. Before this whole process even began, the students of Lasser University were already thinking far beyond competition. Transforming lives is at the heart of our operations from idea to impact. We believe that the power of free enterprise has no limit to its potential. Our team was selected to serve as a representation of what students can do to change the world. We don't have to wait to make a difference. We can do more as students than we ever before thought possible. All around the world, people's lives may be stripped to the very core. But that core is all we need to build something even stronger. Our team will continue to work to make a sustainable difference in the world and demonstrate what students are capable of. When you see what less than 35 Lasser University students can do, imagine the potential for change by students all around the world. This story, this message, this passion is what our team took to the World Cup competition in New York City. And it is a message that will be carried on for years to come.